Hey guys, Sinekropi here, just getting ready for another really long week coming up. I wanted to talk about the importance of maintaining muscle mass. Now, it's not just um, for the sake of working out in the gym or vanity or anything like that. Muscle mass is strongly associated with improved both health span and lifespan. After our early 30s, we lose about 3 to 5% of muscle mass per year, and it is critical to maintain it. And there's a lot of good ways to do that. But before we get into that, we've got to talk about sarcopenia, and that is the loss of muscle mass by not doing the thing. So studies clearly show that you have about a 20 to 30% reduction in all-cause mortality by maintaining proper muscle mass. On the flip side, people that were sarcopenic or had very poor muscle mass had a two times higher rate of cognitive decline. And this is a huge problem. So what do we need to do about this? Well, obviously, spending time in the gym with resistance exercises is critical. Now, not everyone is gonna be able to lift a ton of weight, but resistance with bands and other things using it through physical therapy and trainers is gonna make a huge difference in muscle mass preservation. It's also going to be very beneficial if you do get sick or need surgery, because we know that people that have better muscle mass do better in those situations. Maintaining adequate protein intake, at least 1.5 grams per kilogram per day, especially as we get older, is critical. And then we can do other things like proper supplementation, vitamin D, vitamin K, uh, things of that nature. You know, at the end of the day, there are some people that are just not going to be able to do the resistance stuff because of injury or other things. There are devices that we can use to stimulate muscles to preserve that muscle mass. Bottom line is we need to preserve our muscle to live better, to live longer. Hopefully that helped. See you on the next video.